Friday night football turns violent and tonight a parent of a desert high school student is demanding answers from school administrators and police after a shooting happened at the end of the game. And 13 Action News reporter Jeremy Chen right now is live outside of Oasis, Desert Oasis High School with why he's so angry and also why he wants more transparency from school leaders. Well, Todd, Tricia, that shooting happened here at this school last week. The father I talked to says he no longer feels comfortable having his kid attend football games here. Now, this is just the teenagers. This is total true violence. The next time your kid will get killed. Christopher Wagner is livid about a shooting that happened Friday night at Desert Oasis High School. He learned about it after speaking with his child, who is a freshman there. Listen, you can't go to any more games because at the first game there was also fights. Now, I wrote those off just thinking teenage fights, but after this experience, I realized there were much more. Metro Police says at the end of a football game Friday night, a fight broke out to where someone pulled out a gun and fired shots in the air. No one was hurt, and the shooter left the area. Wagner posted on social media and became frustrated by the response of some parents who believed it wasn't a big deal. I believe it's that attitude. That's just how it is, that we're absolutely numb to this, that we can allow our kids, and it's literally okay for that school to have shots fired in the air, and it's like, ah. Just another day in business. Wagner wants to see better security at schools. And not everybody was wanted. A lot of people got through. Walmart has better security than uh, the football game. He also wants more transparency from school and district officials, saying they never addressed why school police couldn't get a handle on the fights and prevent a shooting from happening. If we can't get to truth and the facts about the safety of our kids, how can we make decisions? How can you trust them leading that school? Now, in a letter to parents, the principal of the high school says student safety is very important for them and is also telling students not to hesitate to report any sort of safety issue if they see it. Coming up at 6, we're going to hear from a CCSD teacher about why there might be some violence all across the Clark County School District. Jeremy Chen, 13 Action News.